Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and happy 2021. I'm back with a brand new video and today we will be making salt crusted pork belly with sides. African queen, oh oh oh. You need a hero, someone like me, oh. Don't wanna travel, oh oh. You disappear, then what you got, eh? Hey, taking advantage. That's what your man do. Move on, you can do. If you ain't ready, I wait for you, girl. Long as yeah. it takes, eh? Hey. African queen, oh oh oh. That's what your man do. Move on, you can do if you ain't ready. So, first things first, I flavored my pork belly with garlic and some herbs for about three hours or so. Some people just flavor it with some salt and pepper, which is absolutely fine. It is totally up to you. You will also need a grill pan and a grill rack, just like this one. You will need you will need foil as well. This makes cleaning up so much easier. Then you will need about a cup of water that you pour onto your tray. Preheat your oven to about 200 degrees. Now, for your pork belly, make sure you don't marinate any of the skin and make sure you pat it dry before you make your salt crust. You will need about a cup of salt for the crust. Cover the skin side of the pork belly completely with salt to make sure that you are making your crust perfectly. And to be honest, I was actually so worried about this crust because there is so much salt here, but it's actually not salty at all. Now put your pork belly in the preheated oven for about an hour on 200 degrees. After about an hour, you will see that the salt crust has formed and it will be very easy for the salt crust to get lifted off the pork belly. If you need about 10 more minutes in the oven so that the salt crust can just lift up a little bit, that's totally fine. But make sure you take it off, completely off, and you wipe the salt off the pork belly. Make sure you wipe the salt crust off the pork belly guys and you put it back in the oven for about 30 more minutes on 220 degrees we are now making our crust after about 30 minutes in the oven check and see if your skin has crisped up properly it should be looking very crispy When your skin is nice and crispy, you take out your pork belly and you make sure it has about 15 minutes or so to rest. So you can pretty much make any sides with your pork belly. I've decided to make roasted butternut with some cream cheese, there's spicy fried rice, some potato salad and some greens. And after your pork belly has rested, you can now cut it and serve it. And 
you are basically done just like that thank you so much for tuning in please comment down below on which sides you would pair your pork belly with Do let me know on any other recipes that you love to see on my channel and thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and hit that notification bell. Until next time, my name is Dumi Chiquita. Bye!